And lastly, I'm going to put the little arm there, the linkage arm. And to do that, I'm going to do some more graphics slicing. I'm going to create a sketch first on that face. Slice my graphics. Create a circle. And looking at my drawings, there's a small cutaway drawing right between the two wheels on that uh, part 5 wheel page. And it shows the measurements of the uh, linkage arm. The linkage arm the bottom portion of it is 0.25 inches round so I really just need to put a circle right here I can go ahead and call it 0.25 inches in diameter and next thing I want to do is I'm going to escape out of the circle tool and dimension uh, the position of that circle and at my, my drawings say that uh, let's see, here we go. In the top drawing, you can see it measures from the center axis to the center of that uh, linkage arm at 0 0.70. So I'm going to click here, then the center of my circle, grow up. Whoops, what happened? There we go. Um, 0 0.70. Now that is in its correct location. I'm going to go ahead and exit because I want to extrude that before I do anything else. So I'll choose my extrude tool. It is going to be a distance of my drawings tell me. Uh, again, if I look at that cutaway drawing, I could see that the uh, distance would be 0 0.375. 0 0.375. And click my, or select my uh, profile there. Click OK. Now I'm going to create another sketch right on top of that profile. And that one is going to be another circle. And I just go right to the center here, click the circle tool, and looking at my drawing, I can see that the diameter of that is 0 0.125. So let's see, where are my numbers? Okay, click. Now I'm going to go in and dimension it because for some reason there it didn't show me my numbers. So dimension that circle at, it was pretty close there, wasn't it? 0.125. And I'm going to finish that and extrude it. How far do I want to extrude it? I want to extrude it back at the drawings at that cutaway it tells me uh, 0.125. Now, um, lastly, I want to put a hole in the um, in that uh, end part of the linkage arm. I can use a hole, or I can just draw another sketch, put a circle on it, and extrude it. But I'm going to go ahead and just use the hole tool. And I know the depth of that hole needs to be, and that's if you look at the drawing to where it points to the hole, it uh, shows a circle with a slash through it. That is a symbol for diameter. And the diameter of the hole is 0.625. The next symbol out to the right of that is a um, basically a horizontal line with an arrow pointing down, telling me that is the depth, and it is 0.25. So depth is 0.25, and the diameter is 0 0.065. And let's see, make a little correction there. And let's see, ah, and I want to make it a Concentric. Hope I didn't reset everything. There we go. Um, zoom in here, place the hole, and then of course select my concentric reference, which is the outside of that linkage arm, and then apply. Now we have a link, a uh, wheel. 100% wheel. Yeah, you can color it any way you want to.